Now at noon this Thursday, the developing news we've been following all morning, a car going underwater in East Providence near the waterfront of Bold Point Park. A dive team and responders from several local towns have been working to get the car onto the shore. 12 News reporter Alexandra Leslie joins us live at the waterfront now. Alex. Well, Kate, in just the last two minutes, we have had a major development here. It looks like crews have been able to start to pull out what looks like a navy blue pickup truck out of the water here. We have seen crews here all morning long in terms of police, fire, dive teams, everything to try and get this car out of the water. I want to show you now the video now of what this all really looks like this morning with just a major amount of law enforcement here on the scene in East Providence at Bull Point Park. Mid morning, we were told that a dive team did recover this car and they were working strategically to get it out. Now, if you're driving on 195, you probably could see this scene here this morning with all the flashing lights. East Providence police told us a call came in from a witness close to five this morning who said they saw this car about 50 yards from the shore. Police said they saw the roof of it before it fully submerged and believe that it entered the river from a boat ramp here. A crews did have a tough time getting this car out because of the rising tide, we're told. Now, we do not yet know if anyone was in Inside the car at the time that it went into the water but at one point we did see the state medical examiner arrive on scene for a short time but they left without taking anything out of the water now again we're going to come back live to where this truck is being pulled out of the water right now not clear how long this will take at this time but this scene has already been active for about seven hours today we'll continue to monitor things and bring you the latest as it all develops reporting live in east providence alexandra leslie 12 news